Hello friends, I'm Winston in London, welcome to my channel. Today's video is about San Severia outdoors. While visiting Miami, I came across this species of plant. Have a look. It's one we know very well. It's San Severia boncel. And it was nicely being grown in the ground. That got me thinking. Because I know the plant, uh, let's have a look at some of my plant at home. They are always grown in pots. The reason being that this species or species of Sansevieria are very sensitive to cold. It got me thinking, what is needed to be able to survive as species of plant in the ground? Right away, I was in Florida, so naturally, tropical weather, or at least pseudo-tropical weather. Which means that the weather must be warm, the soil must be porous, and it never goes below, let's say, 10 degrees centigrade, or even 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's look at some other plants. I think it's very important to notice, even here, much of the soil is mixed with grit, pebbles, stones, etc. The porous ambience is always necessary when you're dealing with succulents, okay? So what I'm going to do for this video is to make some collection of things that are necessary to grow these plants either in the ground or in the pot. They're very cold sensitive which means I think below 55-60 Fahrenheit or 12-15 to 15 centigrade you're asking for trouble. I think it's very important to understand that and if you live in a place like I do, London, UK, at the end of October, they need to be protected from cold, any cold or frost. So here's what I want you to do. Enjoy the rest of the video and I will leave you some information below on how best to go San Severia and how best to avoid the cold. Also, if you live in the tropics, well, you have no problem. I'll mention a few things that are still needed. Winston, thank you. <laughs>